240 miles north in Aroostook County, Warden Alan Dudley responds to a call for help from one of his neighbors. Last night, I actually had one of the Amish families come to my house. They don't have phones, so they all know where I live. The Amish in this community are subsistence farmers who steer clear of machinery, working the land by hand. They raise corn for their livestock, having problems with bear getting into the corn. Once a bear discovers a farmer's field, it will eat until the crop is destroyed. Good day, good day. You looking for a job? Nope. I'm not used to that manual labor. My question on the corn, whereabouts is the damage in the back? Is it easy to see? Uh, yeah, yeah, you can see it. Just okay. The it's hugely important, this corn, whether it's for the cows, uh, the horses, they need this to survive through the winter. I mean, winters in northern Maine are, are tough. When they come in, when they spend a little time, they will do some damage in a short time. Yeah, they can be very destructive, believe me. You'll let us know whether they can go in and shoot a bear? Yep. He was asking basically what they could do if they're causing damage like that. State law allows them to actually use lethal means. I just wanted to go down and verify, just look at the damage. The warden service can issue a depredation permit, allowing farmers to shoot wildlife that threaten their crops. But first, Dudley must verify that it is in fact a bear causing the damage. bit here on the edge it's been knocked down but that could be moose or something something's been eaten there it could be coons here's a big pile of scat here all this corn and stuff inside here's a bear trail beat down goes back into the woods it's definitely bear the damage is actually pretty light. In another week, if they don't do something, you're gonna see a lot more damage. So if they were gonna get them, now would be the time. Dudley decides he has enough evidence to issue the family a depredation permit. If you get one, they got 12 hours to report it. In other words, get a hold of me. We just don't want people going out killing uh, animals because they don't like them there. But in this particular situation, there's really not a lot that can be done. These farmers have acres and acres of corn. It's too big to be fenced. Okay, thank you. All right, guys. <laughs>